Good afternoon and thank you for joining us. I'm Sarah Swistak. The current location of Lansing City Hall may not become a hotel after all. Today, Mayor Andy Shore told us the redevelopment plans are on hold until the city can figure out what will happen to the 54A District Court and the city's police lockup. Megan Heiler asked about the delay today. If we have a new city hall, uh, we want to make sure that that uh, that all the details are, are done right uh, and we want to make sure we can keep the cost down as we have to pay that off. Mayor Shore told me while the option of turning City Hall into a hotel is his favorite choice, the city is still weighing its options. He said the main reason for the delay is figuring out what to do with the courts and lockup facility, with the option of joining them together still at the forefront. He hopes combining the two will make it more convenient for everyone, including law enforcement. Uh, having one joint payment center for our residents would be nice. If they're able to find a way to consolidate city courts into one district court, it would pretty much alleviate a lot of the inefficiencies in the system as it stands today. So what's next for the potential facility? They aren't quite sure. Both the city and the county are holding meetings to determine the needs of the courts, lockup facilities, and city hall. Mayor Shore and Sheriff Rigglesworth agree that something needs to be done and they are working to figure out exactly what that is. And we're gonna, you know, we're gonna have all those conversations moving forward, which is why we're kind of putting, putting the other pieces behind. Certainly excited about being in those talks and um, finally coming to some conclusion because this has been on the table for the past 10, 15 years. And that was Megan Heiler reporting. Mayor Shore says there is not a timeline for the process. He also said the goal is to stay under the $55 million mark when City Hall does move because that's the price tag to upgrade the current building.